earth, air, water, and fire, and ether, cleanse and bless my scarred and sacred space. Hear it. Drive away all harm, fear, and negative energy. Only good may enter and dwell here in perfect positivity, prosperity, protection, and harmony. It is so, so, it is, and so must it be. Ashe. Archangel Uriel to the north of me, Archangel Raphael to the east of me, Archangel Michael to the south of me, Archangel Gabriel to the west of me, Archangel Sandipal beneath me, sending up the crystal grid line into my heart, and Archangel Metatron above me, sending down the creator like conscious to my heart and to my mind, so I may function in my true high vibrational radiant, authentic bright self. I beseech thee, I invoke thee, and I command thee to place me in your pure bubble of white light and darkness of protection in this moment. So no harm come before me, no disaster come near my scarred and sacred space, and no negative energies be able to dwell in my presence. It is so, so it is, and so more to be. So be that it is done. Ashe. Gratitude. I welcome in my divine spiritual love war team, my divine ancestors. I welcome in my divine archangels. Light angels, dark angels, I welcome in my spirit guides, guardian angels, and my fairies, Ashe, and I welcome in my divine totem animals. And I welcome, 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 welcome in my divine infinite light beings, all returning subscribers, and all new subscribers. Much gratitude, and I send my pure and positive, vibrant love out to you in this moment, and also the divine healing energy to you in this moment in your present atmosphere may it reach you and find you in goodwill ashe ashe divine healing energy straight from the divine beings ashe ashe thank you divine infinite um ethers ashe we're going to do a love checkup for the love birds out there. Ashe, the Divine Spirit said it's, um, it's well um, intense. Mm, trust. Um, the, intense, the intensity of a true soul connection includes great high and includes great highs and great lows. Okay, so Spirit is saying that in this connection is very it's a very intense connection but there the, the connection will have the ups and downs as all connections do but you know you us as infinite light beings have the power and um the know-how to manage each high and each low divine spirit is saying because we have a ability to trust you need to have you need to have trust in a relationship in order for it to flourish and you know us as light beings we always give um the opportunity for trust before we distrust a person that's just in our spirit that's just in our soul as as infinite light beings as light workers as um star seeds and healers as chosen ones that's just what we do ashe so um maybe the other person that's involved in this relationship, whether it be feminine or masculine, needs to have trust as well. Ashe, for these intense moments that are drawing y'all together. But in, in two are keeping y'all apart. Ashe, divine spirit saying. Illusions, because of the illusions, Ashe. Ashe, but then this could be coming from family, friends, work, Ashe, any kind of society illusions, you know, religion. It could be a, a sort of illusions that's, um, you know, in between the connection. Ashe, thank you, Divine Spirit. I invoke the powers to connect to the energies of the Divine Feminine and the Divine Masculine Twin flame connections. Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit. This is a reading for the twin flame connections. Ashe. Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit. It's 11.55 on the clock. 
one one five five on the clock. Attraction, divine soul counterparts. Attraction ascend ascends um, superficially. So divine spirit is saying someone attraction is superficial. Whew, we don't need that. Maybe this is coming from a past. Temptation. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, goodness. Think careful. Cupid. Think careful about the situation. There could be some temptation. So the Divine Spirit is saying, make sure that you check all those red flags. If you're getting signs of red flags, because, you know, this this could look good and it, it could taste good, but it could be bad for you. So Spirit is saying, make sure you watch out for any kind of temptations and red flags that come about that makes your body feel uneasy, that throws your 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 intuition off, that um, throws your body off. Ashe, um, we're going to figure out why this um, superficial attraction and this temptation is here. I'm feeling like this is... Um, energy that's trying to um resurface ashe we this is a divine collective reading so this is for the collective it may not resonate with everyone so like you know my words spirit's words we say if it does not resonate leave the shit on the table if it resonates scoop it up take it with you and marinate on it because it is for you ashe that is our saying over here in this healing channel. Ashe, thank you, Divine Spirit. I welcome in all loving spirits, all protective spirits, all caring spirits, all healing spirits at this time. Ashe, thank you, Divine Spirit. I invoke all powers to connect to the energies of the Divine Masculine and the Divine Feminine and the energies that dwell around them and the energies that might be going through this present moment in their in their um atmosphere ashe okay so spirit is saying clear clarity take the time to think about the situation to gain clarity so this is um coming under falling under this intensity intense so spirit is saying as much as it's intense maybe it's intense maybe you need to take the time to gain the clarity to figure out why so the feelings are so intense. Spirit is saying, Ashe. But the, it, the feelings are intense because it's true, Spirit is saying. This is clarity that it, it, it's true feelings, Ashe. And right under trust is past lives. So we reunite. We reunite with our loved ones over and over again through many different lives. And remember in the last readings, we were talking about the past lives um, connecting once again. So this, this, this new person, this twin flame is a past life connection, a, a past life relationship that you have already endured, you have already experienced. So in this time... In this lifetime, y'all are meeting up again to rekindle where y'all left off at. And Spirit is saying, have trust in this relationship. Thank you, Divine Spirit. Engagement. Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit. Clarify attraction. Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit. So you 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 may you or the other counter your counterpart may be very divinely beautiful. Or very divinely handsome. Not maybe is. Maybe that's why these superficial um, um, feelings is coming up. Because they see how beautiful or handsome that you are. And they might be intimidated by this. Ashe. But love is falling right under this. Love conquers all. So whoever is having these, these um, superficial um, feelings. Divine Spirit is saying... Love can conquer that. It can be worked out. Um, there's nothing that love, if you truly love a person, can't be worked out. Because um, a, re a re true relationship, it endures highs and lows. It's, it's not always good. And it's not always bad. 
Ashe, spirit is saying, it's, it's equally yoked, Ashe, it's balanced, Ashe, you be on one accord, Ashe, and it's room to disagree and agree, spirit is saying, Ashe, thank you divine spirit, when it comes to obstacles, spirit is saying, it's room to disagree and agree, thank you divine spirit, I invoke the, the powers to connect to the energies of the divine masculine and the divine feminine in this um, divine twin flame love reading. Ashe, rekindle. Okay, every relationship has magical moments that can be rekindled. So, hmm. No, this, this, this temptation and this rekindling, unfortunately... Is um, a past relationship trying to um, surface their way into this reading, Ashe? Because past life is different from rekindle, Ashe? So this is, Spirit is telling me that this is a, 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 old, a old flame, a old karmic, because it's not a flame. An old karmic that had passion, plenty of sex drive passion, spirit is saying, wants to rekindle, Ashe. That's why this is surfacing in your, in your love reading. But it, I, can't, I can't stop it from surfacing in your love reading because these people are still in your energy, spirit is saying. So it will come out and it will be known in this present moment, Ashe. They're fighting... The resistance of letting you go, Spirit is saying, why you're trying to endure a new relationship, Spirit is saying, Ashe. So beware of that. Thank you, Divine Spirit, for that, that confirmation, Ashe. Because the temptation that they had was um, overbearing so, so bad that you had to walk away from the connection. And now they want to rekindle. And Spirit is saying... Um, there's no room to rekindle uh, uh, um, just a, a faulty relationship, a one-sided relationship, an unbalanced relationship, a, um, a, a breadcrumbing relationship, a, a penny-pinching relationship. Ashe, there's no room for that. Arguing, um, um, mistreating, you know, it's, Look, it's got my cards all messed up. Whew. Okay, we release that negative energy. Clarify Cupid. 1203 on the clock. Clarify Cupid. 11, Master 11. Today is the 11th. So, it, that's a master number. You can manifest with that number. I'm not going to take these. Thank you, Divine Spirit. You gave us clear and accurate messages to bestow upon the um, collective ether. Divine ether, give us clear and accurate messages to bestow, bestow upon the Divine Collective for Twin Flame Love Reading. Ashe, thank you, Divine Spirit. Thank you, Divine Spirit. So, illusions came back out again. Ashe. So, Spirit is saying, don't let the illusions steer you from your true love, this Cupid. Love is in the air when Cupid is around. So, don't let the illusions take you off the path of your true love, Spirit is saying. With this, especially with this temptation and this rekindling, Spirit is saying. Stay focused, Spirit is saying. Your soul is... Your soul is preparing to reconnect. Trust in the process. So, this is clarity saying that your soul is reconnecting with this past life that you once lived with um, before this lifetime, Spirit is saying. And your soul and their soul um, signed up for this endeavor, Ashe. So, you're yearning for each other at this moment, Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit. More confirmation on this past life um, energy. Thank you, Divine Spirit. 
Why is this past life energy here? Thank you, Divine Spirit. More confirmation on past life energy. Thank you, Divine Spirit. I evoke. Remarkable, because it was remarkable. I invoke the powers to connect to the divine feminine and masculine energy for this twin flame reading. Ashe and those that dwell in their presence. Openness. So be open and accept divine guidance and in your relationship. Ashe. And I said something about, Spirit said something about the Bible. I can't remember. Relationship, religion. And it's, it's, it's right here. Confirmation. Ashe. Learn. Learn to compromise with each other, Ashe. Through the intensities, Ashe. Like Spirit said, it's okay to disagree, but learn to compromise because you're 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 communicating telepathically, Ashe. And this is a one one. This is a divine twin flame. We said this. This is a twin flame reading. 1111 is an important number for twin flames. It symbolizes the harmony and the balance of soul's counterpart. Ashe. And so you you are attracted. You love each other. Love conquers all. And in this lifetime, the love will conquer. You're, you're, you're communicating telepathically. You're having dreams. You're communicating in the 5D. You're communicating telepathically through the mind, Ashe. Um, that's why when you when you think of your counterpart, they're thinking of you, Ashe. When that counterpart's name just pops up or you just get a feeling about that counterpart, they're thinking of you as well, Ashe. Ashe. They're the reason why they. They're the reason why you get the feeling, Ashe. Ashe. Know that. Telepathic, Ashe. Spiritual. So, like I said, Spirit said, um, your spiritual journey is beginning. So, you could have had some kind of issues with spiritual problems with this past, this past person. Spirit is saying, but, and it could be, it it could be a past. It, it's a past person now because. Your spirituality outgrew this person, Spirit said. Like we all know, it was just a training. It was just a teaching. It was just a lesson. So your spirituality has outgrown this um, this past person. Obstacles. Look for any, look for a way around the obstacles to find happiness. So Spirit is saying, don't let go. Oh, Spirit is saying, let go. Let go. Something is best to let go and let the universe work things out in divine timing. So, Spirit is saying, let go of control. Let go of control and let the, the divine timing play out with this divine connection, Spirit is saying. You're going to get over these obstacles that's keeping you... Um, Apart from each other, Ashe, but this is um, divinity and it is um, meant to be. It is a twin flame reading. I mean, twin flame love, Ashe. It is a past time, past life love, Ashe. So it is destined, you are destined to come together in this lifetime, Spirit is saying. And I just split the card and here is marriage, Spirit is saying. We've seen engagement, Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirit, for that. We're going to get some. This is um, confirmation for those who are still awaiting, still um, not yet connected with their twin flame, Ashe. But Divine Spirit is saying it is in the process. It is divine timing and um, the divine timing. Only, only divine ether knows the time. Ashe. So why you are, why you are um, 
just waiting and being patient and working on yourself, doing your affirmations, doing your self-love. You know, you still need to heal from whatever you walked away from because we are healing. And in order to attract the true love, we have to be completely healed. We don't want to attract anything, like Spirit was saying, with red flags. We don't want to attract anything like that. So we have to be completely healed. So it's best that we wait on divine timing for um, the true proper love that we want to last uh, the rest of the life, our lifetime. Ashe, Spirit is saying. Ashe. Soulmates. Ashe, your soulmate loves, accepts, and uh, respects you. So whoever this person is, they love you dearly. Immensely, they love you. They respect you to the fullest like they've never respected anyone spirit is saying. And they they accept you for who you are. Your spirituality is different. It stands out. It's, it's um, not ordinary like everyone else because you're true and authentic. And they accept that in you, Spirit is saying. Have no worries about that. They don't have any judgment towards you, Spirit is saying. Ashe. And they respect you. Something that the other counterparts did not do, Ashe. They didn't respect you. Intuition. You already know. The answers you seek, Spirit is saying, this is just confirmation. So Spirit is just saying, hold on and be patient. Continue to heal. Continue to work on you. Continue to make yourself thrive and grow as you should. Because right now we're waiting on divine, divine timing. The person is unavailable to give you what you deserve. But um, this, is, this is past energy. That is past energy. I should. That's why. Yeah. Support. Lean on your inner circle during this time. I say. So like Spirit is saying, continue to work on you. Time apart. Some 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 time, some distance will help bring clarity. So this is a mix and match of somebody wanting to be this old energy wanting to be in your presence. Addictions. This old energy. An addiction is affecting this relationship. So this old energy is really trying to break breakthrough with this twin flame reading ashe yeah divine spirit is saying their energy is still um very engulfed in your energy they have not let you go so you be aware of that still working on those cord cutting here and now your true love is already a part of your life thank you ashe Thank you, Divine Ether, for that confirmation. I'm going to put that over here with, yeah, because abundance is on, on, on its way. Your life is going to be flourished with abundance, Ashe. Thank you, Divine Spirits. And abundance does not necessarily mean money. Abundance is um, just being grateful, you know, just knowing that your life is abundant and 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 just looking around and knowing that you are truly abundant and bringing doing those affirmations willing that abundance into your, your life speaking life and abundance and prosperity into your life will first will flourish you with more abundance divine spirit saying i invoke the you are protected I invoke the powers to connect to the energies of the Divine Masculine and the Divine Feminine. Ashe. Don't get discouraged. You are protected again. Don't get discouraged. Continue to love on you because your love is the best love that you need so far as yet right now in this moment. Ashe. Your divine counterpart is on the way. Spirit is saying, true love, Ashe. This is this 
this love is emotionally, physically, and and unconditional. So this is going to be a true love. Spirit is saying, wait, be patient. Patience is a virtue. It's always about patience and 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 knowing that spirit has your best interests, knowing that your higher self has your best interests and the, your your spiritual war team and those who back you in the ether have your highest and best intentions. So ether is saying, wait, be patient, continue to work on your healing, continue to forgive whatever needs to be forgiven within you as you're attracting your true counterpart to you, your true twin flame to you so y'all can connect and and um and ignite one each one another when the time is truly divinely given ashe ashe thank you divine spirit for that confirmation this is still a beautiful reading even though the past energy just um can't let go don't want to let go Healing family issues. Landed right on top of them. Okay. Divine Spirit is saying it is worth the wait. Religion factors. We said that. Attraction is here again. Codependencies with this with this past energy. This could be the one. Divine Spirit is saying this true love could be the one. Wedding, we have it here again. Divine timing is at work in your life. It's worth waiting for. Divine, divine ether wants you to know that it is worth waiting for. Do not rush anything. Um, waiting for something is better than rushing it. I say the attraction is here between the both of you, whether you be masculine. And feminine energy is here between the both of you. You attract you you attract romance roman romantic love by enjoying this full this enjoying this moment fully. Okay, karmic. Okay, I'm gonna get my words out. So, like Spirit has said, continue to love on you. Continue to be happy inside of you. Continue to exercise. Continue to um indulge in your work continue to get some rest continue to be with your family your friends whatever makes you happy on the inside spirit is saying continue to do that as you're attracting this true love this tr twin flame to your life ashe because it's going to involve a wedding eventually spirit is saying ashe this could be the one you already met so this person you already know this person ashe Divine feminines, divine masculine. This person is already in your energy, spirit is saying. So no need to look for it further. Just be patient, spirit is saying. Just be patient. It's, 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 it's calls for true patience in this um this this connection. Ashe, this is a divine twin flame love reading. And um I'm sending out my healing love to all, Ashe, in this moment. And like I said, this is a collective reading. If it does not resonate with you, leave it on the table. Leave that shit right where it be. But if it do resonate with you, scoop it up, marinate, and, and just, you know, be patient, divine, infinite light beings. Because what you desire always desires you what you what you put out there it it you will attract it ashe and you already know about the red flags ashe deeply and 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 truly you know about the pain from the red flags so beware stay mindful ashe always be the master mind of your thoughts, Ashe. Let your process your emotions, Ashe, and and let it go. Release that negative energy, Ashe. Do not hold on to any negative energy, especially from the past, Ashe. 
if you release that negative energy, um, eventually they will have to release you. Divine spirit, divine ethers is saying, Ashe. So I'm going to leave it there and I'm going to send out my beautiful love, my vibrant love, my healing love, my pure love to all my returning infinite light beings and to all my divine infinite um, light being new subscribers. Ashe, gratitude. And if you can please be so kind as to like this video so I can circulate a little faster, Ashe, I would greatly appreciate it. And I send out love, healing, thoughts. May each and every one of you be filled with prosperity in your lives, Ashe. And may you have the peace in you as I have the peace in me, Ashe, Ashe.